Well, let's bring in Nationals frontbencher Barnaby Joyce, the former Deputy Prime Minister. Barnaby, uh, thanks for joining me. We've got a lot to talk about tonight, but I, I just want to ask you about an incident in the New South Wales Parliament where a Labor MP has been forced to apologise after telling a Nationals MP to, quote, F off back to the bush. He did this in front of a group of shocked primary school children that he'd been escorting around Parliament House. Now, I know that you're no shrinking violet, but um, this kind of behaviour in Parliament, not exactly appropriate. And can you imagine if a uh, Liberal spoke like that in front of children? Well, you know, it reminds me a bit of a Bowen you know, moment, isn't it? If you, if you don't like my policies, don't vote for them. Well, if, obviously, for people in the bush, which under his parlance, I suppose, is everybody outside Sydney, which would be Newcastle, which would be the Central Coast, which would be Wollongong, uh, he's told them all to F off. Um, OK. Maybe they'll F off at the ballot box for you. Maybe, maybe, that, maybe you'll understand that people in regional areas, you know, Bush, are you urban sophisticate, you pseudo intellectual, you enlightened, enlightened person. Maybe you'll be a little bit more hesitant, uh, a little bit more circumspect about your narrative, about your language, rather than using a profanity in front of children um, to address a colleague at your workplace. Uh, it just ticks, ticks every bad box. How you act in your workplace, how you carry yourself as an elected member of parliament. In, your, in service of your duty, which is at your workplace. It wasn't at a barbecue or it wasn't at the football. And um, also out of respect for the, your ultimate boss, which is the constituent. He's, he's told his constituency, he's told regional Australia, he's told all the people outside Sydney to F off. And I think when the next election comes, you should make sure that you don't come back. Just don't vote for him. Don't vote for them.